That's right. The love is flowing in the air. Good morning, boys and girls. This is Mr. Ortiz coming to you live with my friends from C24. <laughs> yes, that's right. So today is Friday, April 1st. We are finished with March. See you later, March. That was the longest school month of the year. Now we're in April. Please stand and join us reciting the Pledge of Allegiance and the Diversity Pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible with liberty and justice for all. I pledge to treat everyone as I would like to be treated. I will be accepting of people from all backgrounds and show them respect. I pledge to learn about other cultures and develop an appreciation for everyone's uniqueness. All right, friends. Well, today is Friday. It's Friday, Friday. All right, everyone, that's right. So today is Friday, April 1st, 2022. And today is National April Fool's Day. That's right. So be on the lookout for pranks. No pranking your principal, okay? No pranking your principal. All right, today's word of the day is fumble. Oh, Noah, the word of the day is fumble. <laughs> to fumble is to handle in a clumsy way, fumble. Or if you're familiar with uh, football, you fumble the football. That's kind of what I think of. We have a number of birthdays for today and a lot of birthdays over the weekend. So let's get started. So today we have my friend Caden. Caden's from A6. And we have my friend Danny from C23. Let's hear for them today. All right. Happy birthday. Then we have five friends plus an adult birthday over the weekend. So we have Kira from B25, Searsha from C2, Jace from B3, Liam from B24, and Jared from A26. And we have a teacher birthday, Mrs. Passini. Happy birthday, everybody. That's right. Mrs. Passini's 21 years old. Now, we have a special bulldog bone for someone who does a lot of great work for us here at McDonald, Mr. Craig. Let's hear from Mr. Craig. Yeah. yeah. So, yeah, we love Mr. Craig. Well, he really earned this bulldog bone because he helped a first grade friend. Now, you might be wondering, what did he do to help this first grade friend? Were you wondering that? Yes. 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 Well, I'm gonna tell everyone, he helped this first grade friend by getting her ring back. And you might be thinking, oh, okay. Well, there's more to the story because this ring was in a really, really interesting place. See, this friend was in the bathroom and the ring fell in the toilet, but Mr. Craig, that didn't deter him. He put his gloves on and he got the ring out. So let's hear it for Mr. Craig. <laughs> Yeah. All right. We love you, Mr. Craig. Keep up the great work. So this week's Bulldog Pride Challenge, if you remember, is about showing initiative. So when someone asks you to do something, make it a point to maybe even exceed what they're asking you to do. So if, friends, if someone asks you to do about like five minutes of Lexia, maybe you want to do 10 minutes. If someone asks you to clean your room, Clean your, clean your brother's room too, or maybe your sister's room. Two rooms are better than one being cleaned. So whatever someone asks you to do, go that extra mile, show that initiative. That'll be greatly appreciated. Okay, I have a message for all the safeties. There's going to be a, a, a meeting at the bottom of the stairs on the third grade side of the school uh, at it's nine o'clock today for a picture for the yearbook. So please make sure you wear your belt and don't miss this meeting. All right, we're going to throw it over to James, the weatherman Lamoureux for today's weather update and Olivia, the sports lady for today's sports update. Take it away, you two. Good morning, Bulldogs. Today we might see some sun in the morning and clouds in the afternoon. It will also be windy with a high temperature around 54 degrees. 
Before I get to today's national day, I have to tell you about something big happening with the weather. There's a major snowstorm on its way, and it will probably close school for a whole week. April Fools. April 1st is known as April Fools Day. It's the perfect day to play a prank on someone. Have a fabulous Friday and a great weekend, Bulldogs. Bye. Good morning. Here's another sports update. The Phillies beat the Yankees, and they signed j Roll to be a helper with the Phillies. And there's going to be lots of hockey and basketball this weekend. Bye. Thank you, James and Olivia, for that update. Weren't they great? Yeah. Oh, yeah, we love, love James, love Olivia. Okay, friends, let me just double check. I believe those are all the announcements we have for today. Yes, they are. So don't forget, one more thing. It's Friday, Friday. That's right, it's Friday, April 1st. Have a great learning day. Remember the four B's plus one. Be kind, be safe, be ready, be your best. And the fifth B. Have a great learning day. Adios.